during that time, my dad was trying to find some, some way to bring our family together. And so we were, I guess, we used to be Catholic. And, and so he's like, well, let's go to a Catholic church, see what that's like again. And, and I was like, no, <laughs> it didn't, it didn't really work out. And then, so we were sort of, he was sort of like church hopping, going to different churches, taking the family there on Sundays. And after a while, I was like, I'm, I'm a teenager. I got my own thing going on. But seeing them actually change once they went to the church, to, you know, the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, once they were there, they, like, yeah, like there was a complete change in, in everything that they did. Um, and then when I started attending for a while, like I, I sort of had social anxiety to be around people. But then, like, the, the kids in my mutual and in Sunday school, like, they started to, you know, warm up to me and talk to me. And, like, and they became my friends there. And, and it was nice because then it was, you know, I have some friends here that are helping me out to, to not feel so awkward or feel weird of what's going on. Because my first visit to church, I sat in sacrament, started feeling really anxious, and I just stayed outside. And I didn't know that the meetings were three hours long. So I stayed outside the entire time just walking around the church trying to find something to do. And then I remember uh, one of the elders came to me and he's like, I want to give you this book. And it was the Book of Mormon. He had wrote his testimony inside. And, and I still have that book. And that's the main one I used to study my scriptures with. Um, and like reading that for the first time was impactful. Like it was this testimony and I was like... I was like, well, this is weird. At first, I'm like, oh, a book, awesome. And I didn't know what it, was, what it was all about. But then reading his testimony was impactful. And just seeing all those little bits and pieces just come together, like how the church was organized, that it made sense. Like it, it held to some of the views that I believed that I didn't see in other churches, like things that, you know, God is, you know, has a body of flesh and bone, things like that I was imagined and, and pictured and, it all made sense to me in that, you know, if church, if um, Christ was going to have his church on earth, he would lead it. And, you know, there'd be prophets. Like, if there's prophets then, why wouldn't there be prophets now? And hearing all that, it just all of it just made my testimony grow. And then personally, doing my own studying and everything, yeah, just, you know, the Spirit would confirm to me multiple times that yeah, it was true. What I was hearing, what I was seeing, what I was experiencing. So...